What's popping, yo? Show boy don't pee. <laughs> the ape in the flesh, baby. Giving you another Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay. I know I haven't been on for a while, man. Uh, I'm dealing with certain things here and there and uh, and just trying to you know manage time the best that I can. But uh, I haven't done uh, this type of uh, video in a while. I've been streaming a lot uh, and trying to get, you know, just get material yeah, on YouTube pretty much. But uh, this is Domination on Piccadilly, the, probably the worst map in the game. Uh, and, uh, and it's a very old gameplay. You can just you see that B is on the, on the fountain. So you can tell that this is very old gameplay. Uh, the, 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 you could still hear the shot, like the enemy can hear the shatter and the call outs. So it's very, very old, very early. When, uh, um, a very early part of the game when it came out. But, uh, I just playing the game, man, you know, doing it the way they want you to do it. I just want to talk to you guys a little bit about, about this game. And uh, what's going on with Call of Duty lately, man? Uh, Call of Duty, you got now you got two used to be three, th three, but you now you got two uh, developers. Uh, on, both of them working for Activision. Activision bought them out a long time ago, which is uh, Treyarch and uh, Infinity Ward. And now Damn, these two developers. Do have uh, one person calling the shot? We're gonna call the shot caller. You got the shot caller that uh, makes all the decisions and and uh, and and tells the developer, the the the, the creative team, what the, what their own vision is for the game, for the next installment of Call of Duty. Uh, I don't know. They train. They 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 thought process or making a decision and and coming up with the vision of the game um, all I can tell you is that it seems that they are going they they take in consideration what people talks about but they heavily seems to con to to take in an account what what what's the hottest game out there and because you can tell that for the last I don't know how many years uh, so I, since Modern Warfare 3, uh, the, the developers, the, the shot callers from each developer t uh, uh, studio, um, uh, they, they, they have imitated games. So they, they heavily, their, their vision is heavily influenced by whatever is hot out there. And, um, and that's what's going on with these games lately, you know. Um, back in the day, you know, Call of Duty was the trendsetter. Everybody out there was trying to imitate Call of Duty and, and, and trying to do it better than Call of Duty. And now, sadly to say, this the the the, the Infinity War and Treyarch went from being the trendsetters to be the followers. And just trying to see what's was hot, and trying to imitate it, and trying to make a, a, a kind of like a Call of Duty version of whatever's hot out there. Now, what you got with this game right here? Um, this game is uh, at the time that the developers were um, coming up with the game and, and, and pressing ideas or whatever. Um, uh, the six. Um, what should I call it? The uh, Rainbow Six was out, you know, and uh, and it was hot. And so uh, Rainbow Six was out. It was hot. Battlefield was out. Um, you know, I think uh, probably the the one with the lady with the wooden leg or whatever. And um, you know, so you had a couple, you know, games out there. You know, especially Rainbow Six was pretty hot. And and uh, and uh, and this game seems to like 
being influenced by by that game. Uh, people was asking for this kind of game. Everybody wanted to go back to modern day uh, warfare type of a style of game. So they're trying to please those people too. So at the end of the day, what they did was they said, okay, let's make a realistic shooter because you know Rainbow Six is hot. People is playing it. People like it. You know, this is the the trend now. Is this kind of game? This kind of game. So let's go back to our roots. Let's bring that kind of game back, and and but we gotta make sure that uh, we don't make it too difficult for people to play. You know, we gotta make it easy. We gotta make it uh, uh, so that people who are not really that good at the game, the the average people and those who are not good at the game, which are the people who are about. 80 percent i mean that kd is about 80 80 uh it's about 0.80 or, or 0.75 or whatever and those who had the kd worse than that those type of people can can get jump in and, and have a safe space to to play and they say this in the interviews you know this is no no nothing new this is not a new slash this is nothing uh this is not rumors it's just facts they talk about this in interviews. They want to create a safe space for those people who are not that great at the game. You got you to gotta take in consideration this, that this, and I'm not making excuses for the developers. Personally, um, I, don't, uh, I don't find this type of game entertaining. I find it very boring to play, uh, and that's one reason why I don't really... F um, in all the Call of Duties, I will make ways to play the game. And I'm doing the same thing with this game. If I if I don't have the time, I don't play it. That's just how it is. Yeah, I don't force I don't I don't I don't stop doing something to play the game like I used to, where I would stop doing stuff or I just uh put stuff to the side just to play the game. Uh that's not the case with this game. Um so that's what's going on, man. Even though know, Black Ops 4, Fortnite was hot, so they yeah, trying to first, imitate 20, that game, 20, 20 you know. And, and 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 so you can see, uh, Destiny was hot, so they're trying to imitate. You know, when they when these developers they sit down and they come up with a vision for the next installment of Call of Duty, they're going by what's hot at that moment. These people were sitting there, doing, putting stuff together, bring brainstorming about the next Call of Duty three years ago. And three years ago, whatever was hot, that's what they're gonna bring out. It's sad, but that's what's going on with Call of Duty. Um, so, uh, lucky for us, uh, Treyarch, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna call it luck, but it's just Treyarch uh, is the one coming back. So they only had like a year so we have to see what they're gonna what they're gonna bring of course right now as we see right now there's really nothing hot right now uh with, with this with the, 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 you might not agree with me but if you look at the at the at the at the, at the games right now that are out right now this game is the hottest game right now you know they the, the first weekend they sold 680 80, 80, they made 680 million dollars in this game so maybe Treyarch will um take this game make their version of it like it used to be you know and uh, and, and 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 kind of fix what these people don't don't can fix or they're just not willing to fix you know and and maybe that game will be a better version of this game um but anyway, that's for me for now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button. Share the video if you like the video. Till next time, it's your boy Don't Pee. Signing out. Salute.